If you want to move cows in open pasture, you got to get yourself some cow snacks. You learn pretty quick when you're working cows, it's a lot easier to pull them than to push them. You can honk your horn or ring a dinner bell or play a trumpet, it don't really matter. As long as you do it every time you feed them, they're going to come running. Properly set up chute system makes all the difference in the world. You gotta have a squeeze chute where you actually trap the cows, but you gotta have pens and you gotta have chutes to get to the squeeze chute. Me and my neighbor collaborate because he's got a better corral system than I do. I'm putting on a number tag on the cow's left ear. Then I put a diazinon ear tag on the left ear. We alternate between diazinon and permethrin. I like to spray the injection site with iodine, but not everybody does this. We like subcutaneous injections in the neck. It's one of the cheapest cuts of meat, and so if uh, it leaves a blemish, it doesn't mess up the carcass. Other people do intramuscular injections. <laughs> Then we apply some Poron Ivermectin, which is an anti-worm, anti-grub medication. If everybody knows what they're doing, things move along at a pretty good clip. We got ours done in two and a half hours. But I can remember a time when people used to say, if I helped, it was like having two good men not show up. We inject 5 cc's per head of triangle 10, then 2 cc's of a 7 or 8 way black leg vaccine. You're really supposed to inject these at least 4 inches apart, but you know what, that's a pain in the butt and we just do it wherever we can reach. Pay attention to what you're doing. In my part of the country, cow versus human accidents are more common than car versus pedestrian. The real key to working cattle is to work calmly but with a purpose. There's no need to scream and run around. Roger likes to clip his cattle's horns. He's watched uh, too many matadors get gored, I guess. Proper vaccinations and worm control means healthier cows that weigh more. You get more for them at, uh, at auction. It's worth your time. Thanks for watching. The Fritz 423 out.